experimenting with 4 methylaminorex. 20 mg vaporized, not sure if I caught all the vapors with my glass straw. The smoking root, choke choke, is really losing its appeal with me. Really nice clarity to this drug. I can see how people would use this for work enhancement and brainstorming purposes. I actually feel much calmer and more relaxed than usual. Perhaps my baseline functions at an attention deficit type norm. At the current dosage there isn't any striking U4AA, but I can see how it could develop into that at a higher range. So far high marks from the licky toad on this one for clarity, function, verbal command, and writing ability. The downside to this compound is that it lasts a very long time. Too long in fact, 14 to 16 hours. I dosed around 10 a.m. and was wired up all day and evening until 3 a.m. the next morning, at which time I finally fell asleep for a few unrestful hours, then tossed and turned for another hour, which finally gave way to a full three-hour deep sleep cycle. I was surprisingly not tired the following day, and was certainly in very high spirits. It's too bad this whomper stomp of a stimulant keeps on trucking through the night. I rarely have utility for such an effect, and I prefer to keep my sleeping cycle in sync unless I'm going for a gonzo trip or other such major event. I'm pretty much a stimulant virgin, and have only explored and experienced a few of them. Caffeine has never appealed to me much, and ephedrine makes me feel way too jittery and annoyed. From what I have observed in others the potent stimulants require a fair bit of self-control to moderate their consumption. I've seen one clear example of meth psychosis in a person I was once close to, and it's certainly not an optimal state of being. Rotate and integrate. My mantra.